Venice, Louisiana is a little over a two hour drive from the Mississippi Gulf Coast. You get a pretty cool little ferry ride mixed in going across the Mississippi River. Once you get across, you're in Bell Chase. It's nothing but highway headed south till you get to Venice. You really feel like you're at the end of the world once you get there. Now this town was built on oil money in the Mississippi River, but what has made it famous is offshore fishing. Yellowfin tuna, wahoo, dolphin, and even blue marlin. Whatever you want to catch, you can catch it out of Venice. They've got a great snapper fishery, inshore fishery as well. But if you want a big brute yellowfin, it's one of the top places in the world to go to. It's only 18 miles north of the mouth of the Mississippi River. From there, depending on the time of the year, it's a short run out to the tuna grounds. Anytime we're planning on going offshore fishing, the Sportsman's Lodge in Venice, at Venice Marina, they're definitely at the top of our list. First class accommodations, room for up to 20 people, and the meals are incredible. I'm gonna tell you what, they treat you first class, feed you great, comfortable rooms, Everything's nice and clean. You're gonna wake up refreshed in the morning and head out for a great day of fishing. If you're thinking about making a trip down, these are the guys you gotta call to make your reservation. Hey y'all, thanks for tuning in to another great episode of the Fisherman's Guide. We got the A-Team on board for you today. Kevin Riley, Dad Super Palm, Brad Parker, Kurt Satchfield, and my favorite offshore captain, Joey Davis of Voodoo Charters. Tuna Town, USA, baby, it's gonna be a lot of fun. Y'all stick around. Typically, first thing in the morning, as you're running down river, sipping your coffee, thinking about what's gonna happen throughout the day, your main focus is figuring out where you're gonna catch your bait, and if that bait spot doesn't work out, where you're gonna go from there. Obviously, once you get done making bait, you're headed to the fishing grounds. It's always nice when you pull up first thing and you're able to put a fish in the boat. But sometimes it doesn't work that way. Sometimes we run around for a little while, try and find a fish, get on top of them. Once you put the first one in the boat, it's all about having fun. So we're out here fishing these structures in this deep water. And the structures all hold bait, which in turn causes tuna to be around. But not only do these structures hold fish, they also play a huge role in the production of oil. The ships and boats out here service the rigs. The drill ships drill the wells and the production platforms pump the oil into land. So they actually serve a lot of purpose. Not only do they put food on your plate, they put gas in your car. Choosing a reputable guide with quality equipment and the knowledge to get things done is critical to your success when fishing in the Gulf of Mexico. It's a vast fishery, tons of open water, with very little structure in the grand scheme of things. Hey, it's like my buddy Captain Joey Garriga always says, catching the fish, right. that's the easy part. Parking the boat in the right spot, that's tough. So we just got done catching bait off this little hotel over here. Uh, pulling up to Tinkerbell right now, we're gonna see if we can mark some fish and put them out. How deep are we here, Joey? It's about 3,000 feet right here. So we can't touch bottom. Yeah, you ain't, you ain't touching bottom. All right, let's find some tuna. They're out here. Oh, there he is! Yes. Hooked up. Oh, he pulled. I just saw a big boy come out. Hey, just got all the bait set. We're live chumming in 2,000 feet of water. Hooked up. Hey, Brad almost lost the fight getting here. Let's see if he wins his first fight on the boat. The Fisherman's Guide is brought to you by Silver Slipper Casino, Dad Super Pawn, Abu Garcia, Berkeley and Penn, Oddball Tackle, Salt Life Optics, Southern Building Supply, Sea Mule Fishing Carts, Catcher's Mitt, 
Sea to Swamp, Island Marina, Hook Gulf Coast Cuisine, Ocean Marine Group, Parker Poles, Sport Trail Trailers, and Advanced Marine. Come on down to the Silver Slipper. Hi, this is John from the Silver Slipper, where the casino action is always lively and fun. Now you already know that we're passionate about our food, and I'm sure you'll be able to find your favorite table game in the newest slot games available whenever you visit us. So now we're happy to introduce our beautiful new beachside hotel with 129 spacious rooms and suites. So for great fun, food, and awesome views, come on down to the Silver Slipper. Pass a good time at the Silver Slipper. Just like money in your pocket, that's super fun. When you trade with us, you always get a bet. Building a new home? Build it with brick and roofing from Southern Building Supply. Come see our showroom on County Farm Road in Gulfport. We have a wide range of brick in the most popular styles and colors, and our selection of high-quality shingles can add years to the life of your new roof. Southern Building Supply offers on-site delivery of your new brick and rooftop delivery of your new shingles. We're the only locally-owned roofing and brick company. Call us today, 228-539-8380. Southern Building Supply. You know, one of the most fun parts about offshore fishing is its big boats. You get to bring all your buddies along. For me, that means I don't have to fight these big fish. For everybody else, that means we can cut up and pick with each other. Some of it's serious, but most of it's just having good fun and poking fun at the other guys. Brad Parker's number one on the board for our Tuna Town adventure. This man totaled his truck on the way down here, Lake Pontchartrain Bridge at 65 miles an hour, rented a car, drove in in the middle of the night. We all voted. He got the first yellow fin today. Good job. Appreciate it. See, we doing a lot of time. As he pulls back up and sets his drift to where we're drifting on a certain line. You now, like, I'm not seeing that. Earlier in the I year. I what you're saying. I totally understand what you're saying. And later in the year, we'll take that board and have it back there with that bonita that's in there. Yeah. We're cutting chunks of chum right. and throwing that over constantly and making a chum line behind us with our drift. Come here, one of those. Those little pieces of chum in the water. And that bait's gonna drift down. Basically, we're gonna put the hook in this and you just want it to drift down the same as those baits. So, slide the hook in there. You don't wanna pull, pull tight on the line do the hook will come out I mean any kind of tension whatsoever but at the same time you don't want too much line in the water so you're just gonna let it drift down drift down if we're marking the fish pretty deep so it's gonna drift a pretty good ways down so just keep on rolling all right somebody want to come grab this one you got it go for it Kevin don't let that fish whoop you son have you got him or has he got you I got him come on now I hope you can reel a tuna up better than you shoot fish with a boat. No problem. He's coming on the boat. He might not know it yet, but he's coming. I got something for him right there. There we go. Color. Got him. You ready? So these reels we're using today are Penn International 30 wides. They don't have a level line like most conventional reels. So if you're reeling in or fighting a fish, you've got to guide the line with your fingers back and forth as you're bringing it in. If you don't, it'll all pile up on one side and end up wedging in here. You won't be able to fight the fish. You're gonna end up losing it and breaking your line.
My family and I have lived on the Gulf Coast our entire lives. The fishing here is wonderful. The trout, the tuna, the marlin, any kind of sporting event you want to do here, from hunting, fishing, it's all here. Pro tips are brought to you by Dad Super Pond. Hey folks, Fisherman's Guide Pro Tips brought to you by Dad Super Pond. We're over here on Bayou Caddy at the Silver Slipper Casino again today. Gerald Gaspard came over to hang out with us again today and tell you all about some great products. Penn won an award at ICAST this year with this one. Gerald's going to tell us a little bit about the Penn Slammer 3. Uh, the Slammer 3 is, is a, a continuation of what they, they had about three or four years ago and they brought back it brought it right back with a bang. You've got, uh, and again, like, like um, uh, Ronnie said, it's, it's, it won the award at ICAST. It's got the CNC brass gearing. It's got a, a sealed alloy frame all the way around it. The drag sealed, the bearings are sealed, the back gears are all sealed. You're looking at a reel that's 30 pound drag to start with. If you go to the big 10,005 size, you got a 60 pound drag. You can pull up an anchor with it. Fantastic reel. Well, I tell you what, you know, I say it all the time, Gerald, Penn is a purely saltwater company. If you're gonna really get after the big fish and spend time out there in the harsh environments, Penn's the way to go. They'll last all year long for you. We put them through the ringer throughout the year. We fish almost every day, and they make it through the full season and even beyond with us. We're gonna pull back around, reset. Y'all stick around, because we'll be right back after this. I'm Shaw Grigsby, and this is my office. A sensational light tackle series saltwater boat from Triton. Whether you're sneaking up on monster reds in skinny water, fishing a tournament in a coastal bay or river, or headed for light offshore action for the trophy of your dreams, no other boat fishes, performs, and fuels your angling passion like a genuine Triton LTS. See them today at a nearby Triton dealer and at tritonboats.com. For over 80 years, serious anglers have depended on Penn. You can too. When you get that bite of a lifetime, be confident knowing that Penn is with you. Penn, let the battle begin. Just like money in your pocket, that's super fun. When you trade with us, you always get a best. Super deals are why, whether you sell or buy. We cash checks, we pay bills, we make loans like no one will. And help you keep your pockets filled. Just like money in your pocket, that's super fun. Come on to the Silver Slipper. Hi, this is John from the Silver Slipper, where the casino action is always lively and fun. Now you already know that we're passionate about our food, and I'm sure you'll be able to find your favorite table game in the newest slot games available whenever you visit us. So now we're happy to introduce our beautiful new beachside hotel with 129 spacious rooms and suites. So for great fun, food, and awesome views, come on down to the Silver Slipper. Pass a good time at the Silver Slipper. We knew right away it was going to be a great day. Why do I offshore fish? That's a question I often ask myself. Check this out. Somebody want to come grab this one? It's something that I'm really passionate about. I know Go there's mornings where it's tough to get up and, you know, you're dragging yourself out of bed and you're finishing your first cup of coffee. You're just antsy to be out there and get after it. It's mid-afternoon. We've already got fish on board. Everybody's kind of relaxed because we're happy about the fish. Bam! Oh, yeah! Now we talking, baby. Everybody be doing it. I think I said that last time too.
Mm -mm. Don't let up on it. Having a captain that knows how to maneuver the boat will greatly increase your odds at landing one of these fish. We tell Kevin to start reeling fast because Joey's going to turn into the fish to gain line. Well, as you can see, I'm clearly getting tired. He's wearing me out. Captain Joey maneuvers the boat to bring us around, to give me a little slack, and to help me reel in the line. But Captain Joey did a great job helping me out. I'm doing all I can do to bring him in, and we land the big fish. Chumley would have had that fish in by now. Chumley's a moron. <laughs> you want the harness? Bring him in. Come on, come on, come on. Man up. There you go. Come up and reel down. Boy, I tell you what, who needs enemies with friends like these? Everybody wants to catch the big one, but halfway through that battle, we're just glad that we get to kick back and pick on Kevin the whole time he's fighting that fish. Hey, that ain't, that, that's on the gunner wall. What you talking about? I think he has about a 40 pound. Probably 25. 25? Probably about 5 pounds. Oh yeah, baby, come on. You want me to blow in your ear a little bit? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> you, uh... It's not reeling in, Kirk. Every time I reel. Every time you go, it's taking line right now. You get in line. Keep going, keep going. Don't stop. Come on up. Yeah, he's mad. He's tougher than you are. <laughs> You're getting real close in the center. You got to guide that line over to the side. Throughout the fight, the tuna is going to try and break your will. And you just have to keep in mind, if you're resting, he's resting. So you keep steady pressure on that fish to break that fish's will and get him to come up to the boat. <laughs> my mama go, that's my boy. Yeah. Hey, uh, you got that gas? Yeah, right here. Oh, there he is. I see you, son. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Yeah, we got color. You almost there, Kevin. Oh, yeah, we got color. You almost there, babe. Yeah. Oh, come on. I thought you were freaking damn. We got the leader. Come on. You got him right here. You in the, you in you at the goal line. We are at the goal line, right out there. There's the fish. Oh Lord, he's about to make a dive. Oh Lord. Go, 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 Oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh, baby. Yeah. Come on, Kevin, keep it up from there. Don't let it go there. All right, come on, real, get real. some. Come on, really. All right, let me get my right friend. Right here, right here. Right here. Over here. Oh, he's a good fish. Real good fish. He's a good fish, Kevin, get the fish in the boat. Come on, man, you're at the five yard line. Let's get him in. Come on, he's right there.
Come on down to the Silver Slipper. Hi, this is John from the Silver Slipper, where the casino action is always lively and fun. Now, you already know that we're passionate about our food, and I'm sure you'll be able to find your favorite table game in the newest slot games available whenever you visit us. So now we're happy to introduce our beautiful new beachside hotel with 129 spacious rooms and suites. So for great fun, food, and awesome views, come on down to the Silver Slipper. Pass a good time at the Silver Slipper. Just like money in your pocket, that's super fun. When you trade with us, you always get a bet. Building a new home? Build it with brick and roofing from Southern Building Supply. Come see our showroom on County Farm Road in Gulfport. We have a wide range of brick in the most popular styles and colors, and our selection of high-quality shingles can add years to the life of your new roof. Southern Building Supply offers on-site delivery of your new brick and rooftop delivery of your new shingles. We're the only locally owned roofing and brick company. Call us today, 228-539-8380. Southern Building Supply. I'm Shaw Grigsby, and this is my office, a sensational light tackle series saltwater boat from Triton. Whether you're sneaking up on monster reds in skinny water, fishing a tournament in a coastal bay or river, or headed for light offshore action for the trophy of your dreams, no other boat fishes, performs, and fuels your angling passion like a genuine Triton LTS. See them today at a nearby Triton dealer and at tritonboats.com. For over 80 years, serious anglers have depended on Penn. You can too. When you get that bite of a lifetime, be confident knowing that Penn is with you. Penn, let the battle begin. Today's recipe is brought to you by Sea Mule Fishing Carts. Hey guys, today we are going to be taking a lighter approach. We are preparing a seared yellowfin tuna and placing over a nice fresh garden salad and topping it with a crab and avocado relish. This is one of those refreshing meals you can have on a hot summer day with a nice glass of white wine. One of the best things I think you can put on a salad is fresh seafood. The ingredients for this salad are one seven ounce tuna steak, three ounces spring mix, one tablespoon of toasted almonds, one quartered red tomato, one tablespoon of bacon bits, one whole avocado diced, quarter pound of jumbo lump crab meat, two tablespoons of chopped cilantro, pinch of ground cumin, salt and pepper. For this dish, the first step is gonna to be to make the relish. So grab your avocado and get a sharp knife and just Guide the blade around the edge of the avocado and then just twist and turn and it'll pull apart. And you'll see that the seed in the inside is still stuck on one side. So take your knife and just stick it into the seed, twist it and it pops right out. Then we can dice our avocado, put it in a bowl or a container, throw in your quarter pound of jumbo lump crab meat, add your olive oil, lime juice, cilantro and cumin. Lightly toss this because you don't want to break up those beautiful lumps of crab meat. They're going to be the main eye candy in this dish. You want to keep them nice and jumbo lump. Now once you have the relish made, just stick it in the refrigerator while you prepare everything else. The tuna is not going to take that long, so we're going to make our salad first. Grab any salad bowl, put in your spring mix, quarter your tomato, Toss on top your toasted almonds. So I know I said this was a lighter dish, but we gotta put some bacon in it. So now basically your salad's done. So let's sear the tuna. Now this is a tuna salad, but it's not tuna salad. This is fresh yellowfin tuna, and you can eat this raw right after you catch it, or you can cook it. But the best way to eat this fish is rare to medium rare. Just sear it in a pan with a little olive oil and salt and pepper about 45 seconds on each side 
And you'll see what a beautiful fillet of fish this is, and it holds up very well with everything you put it on. It's basically like a steak. It's gonna hold up very well on our salad. And this relish is gonna go right on top, and it's just gonna be one of the most refreshing salads you can eat. Seared yellowfin tuna salad with a crab and avocado relish. Come on, come on. Yeah, we got color. You're almost there, Kevin. You're almost there, babe. Took me about 15 to 20 minutes yeah. to pull him in. Yeah. Warm me out. We got the leader. Come on, you got him right here. You in the, you in, you at the goal line. We are at the goal line, right out there. There's the fish. There he is, he's on death Come on, come on. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, baby. Bam, oh, yeah. once the fish hooked up, it got real exciting at that point. The big thing you gotta do is keep your tip out of the water, keep your arms up, keep that fish moving. If you're resting, right, he's on. resting. Yeah, he's Don't let him get a breather. Uh, pull him in, keep keep the line tight, keep that rod tip up. Oh, he's a good fish. Real good fish. He's a good fish, Kevin. Get the fish to boat. Come on, man, you're at the five yard line. Let's get him in. Come on, he's right there. Come on, you got it. Take one big breath. He's right there. Pull hard left. Real. Lift up, pump down. Come on, you got him right here. You got him right here. Get him up to me. There you go. Don't put you. Don't hold your fingers on that line. Oh. Come on, you're almost there. Come on, you got it. You're almost there. Come on. I was like, hey man, let me get a rest here. I got this, baby. Let me get my breath, man. I'm pulling it. Done like a pro. I said that son bitch whooped my ass. You think? All right, I got it. You got it? Yep. Kevin Riley with the biggest fish of the day. About a 60, 70 pound tuna. We caught quite a few. We got plenty of meat in the box. We're going to call it a wrap. We'll see y'all next week. Joey, thank you, brother. Man, thank you. Always well, a pleasure. Once again, it was a great trip fishing out of Venice, Louisiana with Captain Joey Davis of Voodoo Charters. He put us on the fish. We got some yellowfin tuna in the box. My man, Kevin, with the biggest pounder, fish today. It was great. It was a great ride. Thank you, Ronnie, for being the host. Thank you, Voodoo Charters Thank and Joey you. Davis, man. We appreciate the great day. Y'all stick around. We'll be back next week. Stop by and check out the Facebook page between now and then. See you later. The Fisherman's Guide is brought to you by Silver Slipper Casino, Dad Super Pawn, Abu Garcia, Berkeley, and Penn, Oddball Tackle, Salt Life Optics, Southern Building Supply, Sea Mule Fishing Carts, Catcher's Mitt, Sea to Swamp, Island Marina, Hook Gulf Coast Cuisine, Ocean Marine Group, Parker Poles, Sport Trail Trailers, and Advanced Marine. Going back to Mississippi.